Hi guys, my name is Robert Feranek and in this video I'm going to show you how you can test and how you can use IMX6 PCI Express interface. For the demonstration we will use this uh, PCI Express Ethernet card TG3468 which is plugged in into our open source IMX6 Rex board. Here you can see the card, here is our board. And to run the board it's very simple everything what you need to do is just recompile the kernel and uh, which has enabled the PCI Express interface and the drivers for this Ethernet card. How to do it? Go to our website, click to software, click here how to use and access IMX6 direct peripherals, PCI Express, here are the exact steps how you enable the PCI Express for the IMX6. You need to do, do it through the make menu config. Here are the steps how you enable the driver for the particular card. And here we disable the on-chip Ethernet so it's not in uh, conflict with the new Ethernet card. If you are using uh, IMX6 Rex board, you can simply just go to here, development baseboard, to the software section and download the pre-built binary, this one. When you download this binary, you may need to update the U-boot, so your uh, board is actually booting from this kernel. I will show you how to do it. I will reboot my board and go to the U-boot. List this and this is important. At this moment we are booting up from SD card. So we need to load this new kernel. See this is the file. This is the kernel file which uh, we are going to boot from and then just reset the board. It's loading the kernel, it's booting the kernel. During the booting you can uh, go and have a look if uh, the kernel was able to find the new PCI Express card. You can see it here. And also here is something from PCI Express. Okay, I will click here so you can see our demo board and the LED of the Ethernet flashing what you may want to do is uh, check if uh, system recognizes your card. Uh, just use this list PCI devices. Here is the PCI Express Ethernet card. Now we can just try and have a look if we can see it. Yeah, it's here. You can see here the onboard Ethernet is even not connected. Now we can just use ping and watch. I'm not sure if you will be able to see it, but here is the small green LED. When you watch carefully, you may see how it will be flashing. See? It wasn't difficult. If you found this video useful, uh, check also next time because uh, we will be putting more videos on this YouTube channel. Thank you very much for watching and uh, see you soon.